Hey y'all, welcome back to my channel. This is Adana, also known as the Afrozine. Today we're reading for the Earth signs, which consists of Taurus, Virgo, and Capricorn. All right. Don't forget to like and subscribe and hit that notification bell to keep track as to when I'm making more videos. To book a private reading with me or shop in my store, all the information is in the description box below. All right. So I'm going for the hippie type. Back in the day, I feel like Woodstock or somebody might be in their 60s or 1960s. Preferably, I'm here in 1968. Okay, so maybe you were born in 1968. Maybe something happened in your family around 1968. But that number is very, I'm hearing prevalence at this moment. Okay. Um, I'm hearing shrooms. So someone is trying shrooms for the first time. I see these like psycho, psychedelic type of glasses, you know, those circle glasses. Uh, what's those, um, that Dwayne Wayne wore, wore when he um, acted in A Different World when he first got on there and he had those little circle glasses. I don't know the name of it, but I'm sure y'all understand what I'm saying. Um, and I just keep seeing like swirls of colors, but there's just the, you know, the seven colors. Roy G. Biff, right? Red, orange, yellow, green, blue, and the go violet. Somebody may be studying up on that as well, too. I see someone concocting something with colors, or it could be, um, here hypothetically, it can also mean that someone is trying to cover you with color. Like, they don't want you to see what's really behind the veil or behind the mask, all right? Uh, I'm also here, a uh, hypocrite. So someone is doing things, but they really don't want to do it, or... They're giving off an illusion that this is really what they like or what they, you know, what they do, okay? Um, very hypocritical, this person is here, okay? Um, this person is stuck in the past. I was shuffling these cards, and this card came out, so I thought it was definitely a uh, um, confirmation maybe for someone. But someone is definitely stuck in the past here. They're very hypocritical. Um, they say one thing, but they do the next, all right? So, for instance, I might say... Um, they care about the environment, but they just constantly like littering, okay? Um, like I said, this person is stuck in the past. Why? I keep hearing um, R. Kelly, I can't eat, baby. I can't eat, baby. I can't sleep, baby. Your song, this is my song, baby. I don't want to do nothing if I... All right, so there is a mature man here with lots of concerns in regards to the past here. All right, what is the concern? What's going on? What's the concern? What is this mature man concerned about? Could be a father, could be a grandfather. What is he concerned about? concerned about health all right somebody jumped too quick when it came to their health maybe they were very reckless when it came to their health someone definitely um may feel blindsided okay with the volcano card here someone is very angry at the decisions that they made um pertaining to their health here all right someone is really in their head about this why Somebody is very regretful, okay? Somebody may be hallucinating or seeing things, all right? Yeah, I'm here hallucinating. Somebody may be hallucinating or maybe utilizing hallucinogenic type of uh, drugs. And that's something that they don't want to be revealed here. Someone is doing hard drugs, all right? This person doesn't uh, feel loved or doesn't know how to love okay and then we have the soul card in reverse here as well too so definitely with this soul yeah this person just doesn't know how to love this person doesn't have a soul they're like a soulless being okay and that shit is real like we do got that shit walking around amongst us all right there's going to be a death here 
there's going to be a death here. It's like somebody died from a broken heart. Or will die from a broken heart. Yeah. Someone's going to die from a broken heart. There's no changes. This person is going down like deeper, deeper into in depression. They're very, they're very dark. I keep hearing family ain't shit. I keep hearing my mom ain't shit. She set me up. So your mother may have set you up. And that was a shocker to you with this spider card here. So set you up, stuck you up, and it was a it was a shock to you. It was something that you would have you would have never fathomed because with this card, uh, you didn't listen. You didn't listen to your intuition. You didn't listen to your gut because you thought, you know, that's my mom. Okay, so mom is giving you a lot of anxiety, all right? Your mother may be a Pisces or a Virgo, okay? Also, what she's doing is she's creating an ally with people, could be karmics, all right? It could be people at your job. So your mom feels very sociable or likes to be out in the scene, out and about, okay? Likes to put on a show, basically that's about a spotlighter, right? And I feel like you guys may go out all the time um, and you guys may look like sisters, okay? This is like a specific channeling for someone on here, okay? And nonetheless, um, your mom knows all your friends. Your friend, your mom, friends know you, okay? So like I said, y'all have like a dynamic type of connection. But I do feel like behind the scene, you're not aware that your mom is like severely jealous of you, okay? With this karmic and ally card here, your mom is creating allies with someone at your job. Okay, um, I do feel like you may you may be trying to come out. You wanted to come out. You could be into the same sex, but you're kind of nervous what your mom would say. Okay, but I feel like your mom is creating tension within your job, the, the dynamics of your job, and it is strongly advised for you to establish boundaries. Because if you don't establish boundaries, you're going to lose your job. Keeper is in reverse. Okay? And that will be because of your mother. Your mother has a lot of hood rat uh, tendencies. She does not want to see you successful. Okay? So someone could be in like a law firm, working for law, could be paralegal, uh, wanting to be a lawyer, a judge. There's definitely some kind of judicial type of um, working or energy uh that's here, okay? I keep hearing that's not it, that's not it. What's not it? What's not it? I keep hearing boys to men. I'll make love to you where you want me to. And I'll hold you tight. I hear that's a long time. Baby, all through tonight, I make love to you. Okay, so what's not it? Yeah, so they don't want to accept that there's a heartbreak here or they're going through heartbreak. All right, they want the Ten of Cups with someone, a happy family. They want to review you with someone. What's not it? Happy reunion, family, heartbreaker. So someone wants to come towards you, but your mom is stopping it. And it's causing tension at your job, your workspace. And you can be an entrepreneur too, okay? Um, but your mom is, is interfering. It could be an aunt, a grandmother, a friend, a friend that you may look at as a mom, okay? But I keep hearing the word mom. So maybe you just called 
you know, if you're not related, you probably still call her mom or mama or moms. I'm here, moms. Clarify this ten of cups for me. All right. One ten minutes. Clarify this ten of cups for me. Thief. So thief is is sideways, right? But I'm gonna put it this way. Four plus two is six. Relationship connection. She's trying to take your connection, your relationship away. Yeah, your mother is against you. Your mother figure is against you. They're a hypocrite. We have the mature woman here. <clears throat> wow, they send a lot of bad thoughts to you. They project onto you. Wow. They want you to be imprisoned and they want you to have bad health. It's crazy. That's the message. I feel like that was the message you were waiting for because it feels like last couple of conversations you had was just off with her. Okay? And you weren't sure, you weren't able to put your finger on it as to why that she may have been off. It's because she's really doing some sneaky, underhanded, weird shit. Behind your back. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Wow. So we have child in reverse. Let me clarify child. Clarify child. Clarify child. Yeah, she, dis she disciplined you for no reason. Service as well. So you may felt like the stepchild. You may have felt like the black sheep of the family or of the children if you had multiple like siblings um she was very 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 hard on you hard on you but on the outside looking in people see her as the official person okay so it could be military it could be police i'm here a sanitation worker i'm here a jedi trick as well uniform correctional be a correctional officer. Um, I hear I hear Putin. I don't know. I heard Putin. Vladimir Putin is what I heard. So I'm gonna I'm gonna say it. I'm hearing catastrophic. That's what I'm hearing. But going back to the service and discipline, she will always over discipline you. Um, yeah, you didn't feel like the privileged lady or privileged child growing up. All right, your mom, mom didn't like you. She actually didn't love you. And I feel like that's a hard pill for, for someone to swallow because, you know, it's your mom, right? Like, you would never think, like, the one person that was there for you since birth would ever betray you, but... Shit, mom is just a three-letter word, too, because sometimes you can't even trust the person that gave birth to you. It's sad, but sometimes that's just the way the world works. And until you realize that there are people, places, and things in many fucked up ways, shape, and form, you're going to keep repeating this cycle, this, this cycle of I'm hearing toxicity, I'm hearing... Um, Toxic child rearing is what I'm hearing. That's what I heard. Um, trauma bonding. Your mom trauma bond the fuck out of you. Okay. Clarify is here. You ask for clarification all the time, but you never get you never get what you are seeking. The alliance card is in reverse. Mom always throwing you under the bus may have talked about your body towards you, towards other people, in front of other people, activated some kind of like protection or wall. Yeah, you are very passionate about that because you don't like tension, you don't like arguing, you don't like fighting. So it was like you kind of were forced 
you kind of were forced into this false narrative that your mother has painted for you with structure um she she also want to control your relationship as well too friendship relationships anything that has a, a vision anything that you visual visualize and you may have said to her she sabotages it and she makes sure damn motion so we got um achieve emotion she makes sure that she go the extra mile to achieve or keep that emotion basically she loves to see you in despair. We have mature woman here again. Yeah. Your own mother loved to see you in despair. Like I said, it's just a three-letter word or a five-letter word. Take it how it resonates. M-O-T-H-E. Oh, six-letter word. Sorry. Um, yeah, they don't she don't want to see you abundant at all. She don't like you. Invitation. Your mom is the life of the party. When she go to parties, it's just, it's a deep, dark issue, like self-love or self-identity issue that your mom is going through, but she projects onto you profusely, but yeah, yeah. I feel like she blames you for the things that she could not do. Yeah, you're very poised, you're very blessed, you're in a new life, all right? Or you're attempting to go for a new life, towards a new life here, with a change in the wind. But be careful, because if you mention anything to her, she's not going to be fair. She's going to psych you out of it. I'm heard you were called greedy, dumb, dummy is what I'm hearing as well. Yeah, the truth be told is the truth doesn't want to be told. She don't want to tell the truth. You're always having to clean up after her because the truth's not being told. And it has you sitting in your head thinking and thinking and thinking. You're thinking, stinking, Lincoln. Maybe somebody called you there as a child. Thinking, stinking, Lincoln or Lincoln, stinking, Lincoln is all thinking. I don't know. All right. All right, we got a Libra here. We have a Cancer here. We have a Scorpio here. One more. Scorpio again. All right. So if that resonates with you in any way, shape, or form, please feel free to like, subscribe, hit that notification bell. Until next time, signs. Peace.